And now for the answer. If I undo the failure inducing change as returned by delta debugging, can I actually build the program? Yes, I can, because this is actually tested by delta debugging that the alternative makes the program pass, so the program should build normally, and also the failure should no longer occur. Whether the problem is properly fixed, though, is another thing. I may have fixed the failure in question, but by undoing these changes, I may have introduced new bugs. In particular, these changes up here were probably made with some specific feature in mind, and the very least that will happen is that I lose the new feature that would be introduced by these changes. So I can't really say that the problem is properly fixed. I need to come up with a change that includes the new features, or at least the effect, or at least the intended effect of these original changes, but avoids the bad effect, namely the failure. So this is the final answer.